on guys welcome with another video today I'm going to show you exactly how to set up your pulse chain test net on your MetaMask but before we do make sure to subscribe to my channel notification button so you'll be notified every single time I make new video and also give this video a huge like if you have any question write them in the comment and we'll be glad to answer them thank you so much let's go into the video quick a quick look at the market and let's see some of the um, performance that we have today. We have a Bitcoin that is up 1.39% for the 24 hours and down 4. Point, almost 5% for the week. Uh, we got Ethereum up 2.2 at the time of recording this video, Binance up 1.5. So we got some movements like, you know, sideways uh, trading in the market, Avalanche hello hello have you listened to me avalanche up 4.4.17 uh, percent and 30 get this 34 percent for the week while well, all the market is going down avalanche is going up and not only avalanche but polygon as well six percent for today four percent for the week i've been yelling if you go to my twitter account if you see my shorts i've been yelling to get the attention on Polygon. Like, you know, I'm buying Polygon, I'm buying Polygon. This is a dip, this is a great opportunity. This is, I don't know if you've listened. If you have listened, congratulations. If you're not, hey, this is not a financial advice, do whatever you want. But for me, I'm buying Polygon, I'm buying Avalanche. These are my 10X, 15X, heck, even, 25x in the coming months altcoins these are the best so this is the tweet from richard hart himself he says pulse swap is going to be called pulse x now there you go can't be more clearer than this All right so without further ado let me show you exactly how to add the test net to your metamask set up the test net play around with it a little bit and also be ready for the main node the sacrifice starts and the gate is open for day one i don't want you to miss day one this is very important this might be my friends lifetime opportunity right here and i'm not kidding i am not kidding this is imagine yourself getting on Ethereum on day one or discovering Bitcoin on day one. So I don't wanna miss this and I don't want you to miss this either. So you go to a place called GitLab. Now if you are like, you know, developer, programmer, whatever, you know these things because you are very familiar with them. But if you don't, don't wanna leave the link in the description. And you just like, you know, copy exact same steps that I'm showing you here. So here's what you do. You go to Pulse, go Pulse, you go to Pulse Chain, and you go all the way down to Pulse Chain Testnet. You click on it, and then you scroll down a little bit, and there you go. Here's the name, here's all the inputs that you need in order to add the Pulse Chain Testnet. To your MetaMask, all right, and even it shows you exactly a step by step. You can copy paste them. You can do like here to all the steps that you need to do. So all what you need to do, just go to your MetaMask, hit the MetaMask, hit um, add network, uh, network name. Come back here, take that pulse chain testnet, copy, paste it right here come back here you take the new rpc url all of it copy and paste now since i already added it says here this url is currently used by pulse chain test net network and you can see it right here in my metamask i am on pulse chain network test net right now so you can Follow the steps, you go to the chain ID right here, copy it, I'm gonna show you, paste it here, 
it pretty much follow their steps, right? It's T pulse, because that's the simple for T as a test net. And finally, you do this, you copy the block explorer URL, and that's it, and you add it. Now, you are on the Pulse Chain Network, testnet, right? Now, if you wanna take it a step further, and you wanna get some T Pulse um, token already in your MetaMask, on your testnet, in order to play around with it. If you are a developer, if you are like, you know, programmer, or if you wanna support like, you know, no creations or delegation, you're gonna need these things, right? Uh, so this might be a little bit like, you know, advanced. For now, it's okay to set it up. So I just showed you exactly, it's super simple. But if you wanna take it to a step further, now you can go to Pulse Chain Testnet to get a faucet. Here, all what you need to do is already connect it to your MetaMask. All what you need to do is to hit request. But since I already requested before, it says you have exceeded your rate limit. Subscribe to the channel and hit that notification button so every single time I release a new video, you'll be notified right away. Stay vigilant and also be ready for the biggest airdrop in the history of your crypto and also don't miss out the sacrifice. Make sure to stay tuned. It's a two weeks. Here's what Richard said and his latest video that he made on his channel. I was watching and he just dropped it like two hours ago, as you can tell right here. It says, bit going, go to zero, Pulse X, sacrifice in two weeks. Actually, if you watch the, the video, uh, the first time he says it's like, you know, within a couple of weeks, but then he said, like, you know, he took a really, like, you know, a couple of seconds to think about it, and then he said, all right, within two weeks. So here we are. We have almost, almost a confirmation that a Pulse swap or Pulse X sacrifice will happen within two weeks from now. So if you have missed Pulse Chain, if you have missed Hex, uh, don't don't miss Pulse X sacrifice phase, all right? Um, this is his channel. Now, if you are not following me on Twitter, make sure to follow me on Twitter as well. I am throwing like, you know, some some really cool stuff here and there. Give this Twitter account some love. Uh, I really appreciate your support, appreciate all the comments and I will go into every single one of them, read them and also try to answer them to the best of my knowledge. So thank you uh, for all the support. Thank you so much. Peace.